What's going on guys? Today, i got a lot on my mind. And the title of this video is, I will not lead my people into a burning house. This is my thesis. Starting a successful small business is better than investing in the stock market. It is better than investing in cryptocurrency. And proof positive of my thesis is the way that I live my life. And I refuse to be, I'm a contrarian. I refuse to jump on this crypto bandwagon. Because I'm going to explain to you who the real people are making the real money in crypto. And it's not the people who are buying cryptocurrency. I have um, put out statement after statement saying, do not buy cryptocurrency. And it is my belief that most cryptocurrency is going to go to zero. It's just a matter of time. And we don't know which cryptocurrencies are going to survive. That is my honest belief because I understand how money is generated. And I've outlined many of the problems with cryptocurrency. Anyone can start a cryptocurrency. Anyone can create a cryptocurrency. That is highly problematic. But once again, let's not digress. Hey, this is Gwendolyn. You should jump into the inter intellectual property school. We're getting into some training. Like once again, you can jump in, get 65% off, hit the link below, and I'm going to teach you how to set up a YouTube channel and make money. I'm going to teach you how to set up a YouTube channel and sell products. I'm going to teach you how to write a book. I'm going to teach you how to create online courses. The intellectual property school is a thesis of my life. I don't tell this to impress you. I tell this to impress upon you. I was able to go to the Porsche dealership, pick out a Porsche, and drop and drive it out with paying a cashier's check. And I asked them, I said, how many people pay cash for these cars? And it's about 20, 30 percent. So I'm not the only one. There's a lot of well-off people who are paying cash for cars. They're not YouTube famous financing a Ferrari and then coming here and flexing on YouTube because they have a finance Ferrari. Um, what I want you to do is I want you to wait until the promo code, you know, because the promo code is over June 30th. What I want you to do is get into the intellectual property school right now. Why? Because your future is waiting. It's going to take time. I'm not going to lie to you. Intellectual property is a something that takes time. You got to set up your YouTube channel. You got to build an audience. It's going to take months. So the sooner you start, the sooner your future will arrive. So go ahead and enroll in the intellectual property school today. Links below. Use promo code creator to get 65% off of the one and done price. So let's get into this video. I got a lot on my mind. I am not leading my people into a burning house. And I'm going to make an elitist statement right now. Not one of you who's trying to convince me that I should be in cryptocurrency, that I should recommend cryptocurrency, or is as successful as I am. And that is appalling. Instead of trying to convince me to come to your side, when you cannot even afford to pay cash for a Honda, when I'm out here buying Porsches, living in a penthouse, eating steak dinners, and I am showing you that, but for some reason, you feel that you are smarter than me because you're young, you're hip, and you're buying cryptocurrency, even though you cannot afford to live the lifestyle that I live. You can't afford it. But for some reason, you feel, you feel that you're on the right path. The majority of people who are investing in cryptocurrency will not become wealthy. The majority. The Winkle Boss trends, or Winkle Voss, their father is a millionaire. Whether they had bought cryptocurrency or not, they would still be millionaire. All of the people, the Winkle Voss trends, all of the whales, 
These are the people who are going to get fantastically rich from cryptocurrency. Not the rank and file because the average person doesn't have enough capital to deploy into cryptocurrency. And that's why people are sitting on Shiba Inu, you know, hoping that it goes to the moon because right now you can get it really cheap. And if it goes to a dollar, you can make all this money. Getting wealthy should not be a plan of hope. I'm actually going to share something with you that the reason I'm up this early this morning, but let's talk about who's getting money in the cryptocurrency market. Graham Stephan, Andre Jack, Meet Kevin, Financial Education, and the people who sell the mining equipment. The people who talk about cryptocurrency, they're making the money. Anyone that has a YouTube channel that starts talking about cryptocurrency, it blows up. So even though they may be participating in cryptocurrency, they're making way more money from their YouTube channel than they're making from cryptocurrency. And I've said it and I said it again. Graham Stephan has a cash flowing business. Me, Kevin has a cash flow being. Andre Jack has a cash flowing business. Financial Education has a cash flowing business. Uh, Crypto Bot, he has a YouTube channel with 1.4 million subscribers. He had he probably makes 250, 300 thousand dollars a month from his YouTube channel. So, yes, there are people making money in the cryptocurrency market, but it's not the people who are buying the cryptocurrency. It's the people who are talking about the cryptocurrency. It's people promoting the cryptocurrency. The people who are uh, recommending people to exchanges. They're making the money. Not the rank and file person who's buying cryptocurrency. I've done a, a lot of statistical analysis. The average person doesn't have enough money. Like I did a video talking about um, Carl, whatever his name is. He's not a billionaire. He did not have enough money when cryptocurrency was 1100 Bitcoin was 1100 bucks. He would have needed 10 million years ago to buy enough Bitcoin to become a billionaire when it was at its all time high. And I've had people say, you know, Carl gets his money from the, he, he, he ain't a billion dollars. And this is one of the reasons that people want to believe this is they can believe it can happen to them. That I can be a cashier or I can be a nurse or I can be a welder or I can be a regular person and then I just buy a little cryptocurrency then a year later I'm rich. That's the fundamental belief that is driving the cryptocurrency market. It is not about fundamentals. It's about not about blockchain technology. For a small percentage of people who are wildly excited about the technology, yes, that's true. But for the average person, they can give a shit about the blockchain. They can give a damn about the technology. It is about, I can buy this little crypto today and then it goes to the moon. That is what has the average person in the crypto market. You cannot convince me any other way. And once again, I have asked people, if you're trying to convince me, someone who has documented proof of success, you can Google my books, you can Google my training platforms, you can look at this YouTube channel and see documented success, documented receipts. Yet when I ask you how much money has cryptocurrency made you, 95% of you will don't answer. And for the few, Kudos to you for answering. In my opinion, you're making chump change. All right, I made $70,000 buying cryptocurrency and now I have solar panels. Congratulations, congratulations. Uh, I've made $70,000 in one day. So, once again, if you're gonna come for me and you like coming for me because part of it is you need people to embrace the cryptocurrency movement so you can make more money. The more people that buy in, the more money you can make. So this is one of the reasons that people come for me. It's like, well, you're a smart guy. Don't miss out. Or once again, and this argument is crazy. I am already rich, okay? So I'm not easily seduced by quick money scams because I don't need money. I have dependable, proven methods of making money. So I don't need cryptocurrency. I don't need it. And let me go ahead and tell you what, why I'm up this early in the morning. I was actually 
sketching out a schematic for my business. And I'm very, very excited because in the next few years, I will make enough money from my business to buy an apartment complex cash. Once I do that, I become permanently wealthy. I buy one apart, just one. And because right now, I'm doing research because I don't know how much this is going to cost me because it's kind of hard to get these numbers. But if I can buy an apartment complex with 500 units and these units have an average rent of $1,800, based upon my research, that's not unreasonable. And then I assume that would cost a hundred million. I'm assuming because commercial real estate is very expensive. So I would put fifty thousand dollars down, fifty million, excuse me, fifty million dollars down, and then borrow another hundred, hundred, borrow another um, fifty million. And I've worked out some numbers to service my debt would be about four hundred thousand. I'm going to say high three hundreds to four hundred thousand per month. Those units would cash flow at 1.6 million per month. So I've deducted that so I can pay that and I have 1.2 million a month left over. And I've accounted for property tax. Uh, I've deducted that and I've accounted for 10% uh, operational cost. And it's still, after paying all those bills, it's still $12 million a year. That's what I'm focused on. I am not focused on no invisible, intangible, made up currency. Because that's what it is. It's a made up currency. And, that, and actually cryptocurrency is a misnomer because very few people use it to actually buy anything. So that's what I am focused on. Getting my business to the point where I can make 50 million Go out and get me this one huge apartment complex, get me a nice one, and then I become permanently wealthy. That's what I'm working on. And I will not lead my people into a burning house. It is a fundamental belief, and I said it before, that cryptocurrency, a lot of it's going to zero. It's just going to melt down. There might be a few that survive. There may not be none that survive. So knowing this and knowing how to make money from scratch, Knowing how to make money from scratch, I have no need for cryptocurrency. And many of you like, well, if you're doing cryptocurrency, you can make more money. Let me tell you something. I am content with the money that I make. Now, for a lot of y'all, that's just crazy talk. I am content to drive a Porsche. I am content to drive a BMW. Both of them are paid off. I am content to live in this high-rise apartment. I am content to eat steak dinners and eat out. I am happy with my life the way it is. Can you say that about your life? Can you say that about your life? I am happy. In the bedroom is my girl. I am happy. I am thrilled. And the only reason that I'm going to shoot for this apartment complex to become permanently wealthy because what's going to happen is that apartment complex is going to be making money long after I'm dead. While many of these cryptocurrencies today are going to disappear to nothing. Nothing. And once again, I am not leading my people into a burning house. I am not Graham Stephan. I am not Nick Kevin. I'm not Andre Jack. I'm not financial education. I am not this crypto bitch. I am none of these people. I will tell you the truth as I see it. And there are many of you who are paying attention, which the crypto bros don't like because they need more people to buy in to push their crypto up. Because crypto is one big hype machine. That's all of it. it is hype. It is based, the price of crypto is based on what someone is willing to pay for it. That's it. It's not based upon utility. It's not based upon utility. And also, with my bet, we're going to use good old plain old American cash. I've had many people try to change the terms of my bet to suit them. Well, let's drop a smart contract. No, fool. What you're going to do, if you have the 10000 and most of you who are trying to get in this bet, don't have the 10,000. 
But most of you don't have the 10,000. But you're trying to seduce me into going into an agreement without you putting up the money. And one of the principles of my bet is you put up the $10,000 into an escrow account. That means you gotta let the $10,000 go, and then when I win, and I would have won because I said Bitcoin was going to go to under 20000 and it did. And it, every other day it does. And it's in a decaying orbit, and it's going to go to twelve. It may go to 7200 That's kind of my target price where I think it's going to drop to 7200 So, once again, do not be coming to my channel trying to rearrange my programming. I've been doing this for 14 years. I've had... 14 years of success on YouTube. So your suggestions, and once again, and many people hate when I say this, if you're not as successful as I am, if you're not, can prove it, I'm not going to listen to you because there are many people who feel that they are smart with no results. I have rich friends who've given me counsel, people who are significantly richer than I am, and when they tell me something, I don't sit and argue with these people. I was like, okay, let me check into that. And I had one friend when I was presenting some of my stuff to him, and he actually poked a few holes because he's a very smart guy. And I came back and I checked my math, and he and I called him up and said, "You're 100% right." See, I can humble myself to someone who has demonstrated superiority, but a lot of you arrogant assholes, you can't because you feel that you're smart. You're caught up. You are a hero in your own mind. You feel that you're so smart because you're very good do good, see. Yet you can't even afford to pay cash for a Honda. I go for results. I go for proof of concept. And none of you, and once again, I'm going to say this, and this may be the latest, none of you who are trying to change my mind are as successful as I am. And I find that patently odd because in the world that I grew up, the people who are more successful are respected, listened to, but I have all of you punks and sycophants coming at me talking about you need to get to crypto girls and you're going to regret. I regret nothing. I'm not going to regret not getting in cryptocurrency for 10 years from now. You know why? Because I'm going to own an apartment complex that's going to be cash flowing and making me millions a year. I'm not going to worry about no cryptocurrency. And I am not going to lead anyone who's listening to this channel to do that shit. I think it's dumb, I think it's stupid, and I have proven if you started a small business that made you $2,000 a month, it is very doable, very doable. You would be better off than buying some fucking cryptocurrency. But once again, you don't like my thesis because that means you gotta get off your sorry ass and do some work. And that's another reason, buy Bitcoin, don't have to do anything. Once again, I refuse to lead my people into a burning house. I refuse. So, stop trying to convince me to come to the crypto side. Because once again, and I, I like, I'm a business owner. I own several businesses. And this is a conversation I had with my rich friends. And we've all been through it. We have started additional businesses and we have lost traction. All of my super wealthy friends have focused on their business and nothing else and that's why they're wealthy. I have a group of friends who are quote investors and they're trying to invest and their businesses are not even as good as mine because they lack focus. So once again, the people who are making money in cryptocurrency have the YouTube channels, they're selling the mining equipment, they're selling the shovels, they're promoting, they have the exchanges. These are the people making the average person investing in cryptocurrency at best might make 10 to 70,000 at best. And to me, that is chump change. That is chump change. Because I have a business that will put me, that has put me in a position to go to the Porsche dealership and roll out with a $120,000 car in the title because I didn't finance it. Because see, I have proven that to you. I've shown you the car, I've shown you the title. And these crypto brothers cannot even finance a Honda. They can't, they can't pay cash for a Honda. They can't even pay cash for a good used car. And once again, I'm a proof 
uh, result concept oriented type of guy. Show me some proof. Show me some results. I think Anton Daniels punk ass is a fake ass millionaire. That's my thoughts of it based on what I've seen. Because I know better. I am not seduced by all of the accoutrements that people put in their videos. Because I know how to make money from scratch. I know how to make money selling physical products. I know how to make money selling intangible products. I've done it all. But once again, many of you arrogant assholes refuse to respect my established resume. And that's the reason I'm making this video. I have shown you proof and you ain't shown me shit. You've shown me nothing. It's just like these arguments. You're going to regret it in 10 years. I'm not going to regret nothing. I regret nothing. So, once again, I refuse to leave my people into a burning house. If you're watching this channel, you're listening to this channel, good for you. If you're like, hey, I'm not going to buy cryptocurrency. And if I can create 50,000 corporate citizens, these are people who have businesses or a collection of businesses that make $250,000 a year. I will touch millions of people. Millions of people. So instead of sitting around like you should buy some Shino, Shibu Inu, or you should buy some Bitcoin, you should buy some. Once again, what I have seen from cryptocurrency is something I want no parts of. It goes up, it goes down. It is highly volatile. And all of my rich friends, my rich, rich friends, think cryptocurrency is a joke. You want to know why? I have a friend who has a yacht. And he has a 200 foot yacht. Google the cost of a 200 foot yacht and uh, I was invited there and we were just sitting there talking and then some of his people who work for him were talking about cryptocurrency and he started laughing he says if you believe in that I got a bridge I want to sell you my rich rich friends they don't believe in cryptocurrency because they already rich they're already rich it's these young bucks it's these young bucks so please stop trying to convince me because you cannot count on my thesis because if you three years ago had started a small business three years ago making two thousand dollars and this year let's say three years in the future you're making twenty five thousand dollars per month from your small business guess what you're at three hundred thousand dollars in gross revenue which will supersede anything that you can do for, with cryptocurrency because cryptocurrency is dependent upon having a cash position deployed into the assets to sit on it. And that's the position that 81% of Americans are not in. They're just not in it. So I refuse to leave my people into a burning house. 